across Montana, county election officials have been deciding whether to conduct this year's general election with all mail ballots or not. As MTN's Mike Dennison reports, most of them are choosing mail ballots, but voters will still have options to drop off their ballot in person. It's been three weeks since Governor Steve Bullock gave Montana counties the choice of going to all mail ballots for the November 3rd general election. Election officials asked for that power because of concerns over finding enough polling places and election judges during the coronavirus pandemic. And as of Tuesday, 40 of Montana's 56 counties have chosen mail ballots. That includes seven of the eight most populous counties, which covers Billings, Missoula, Bozeman, Great Falls, Butte, Helena, and Hamilton. Flathead County in Kalispell is the only large county to stick with polling places for November 3rd. A dozen other counties have made that same choice, most of them less populous rural counties. Two counties will make their decisions next week, Jefferson, which includes Boulder and Whitehall, and Treasure County in eastern Montana. In the counties going to all mail, all registered voters will be getting their ballots the second week of October. And in the other counties, absentee ballots will be mailed out at the same time. Also, if your county sends you a ballot in the mail, that doesn't mean you have to mail it back. You can drop it off at the county election office or in some counties at ballot drop boxes. For example, in Western Montana's Sanders County, officials will be placing drop boxes in towns across the county and at regular polling places on election day. And one last thing, regardless of what your county is doing on mail ballots, you can continue to register and vote right up to 8 p.m. on election day. Reporting from Helena, Mike Dennison, MDN News. All right, thanks, Mike. And the deadline for counties to make a decision is Friday, September 4th.